Hey, hi, Dan Albergetti here, dancecourses.com. And uh, we're going to show you how important the magic number is in answering these types of questions that are in the Cisco CCNA type of question. You're going to get subnetting questions, important questions. You've got to be able to answer these quickly. So here's a sample question. You have a question like this. Is 196.16.144.64, okay, slash 27, so slash 27 subnet mask, is it a host address, a network address, or a broadcast address? Okay, which one? Is this a host network broadcast address? Eventually, if you use this magic number system, you'll be able to answer this question just at looking at it. You'll have the answer just like that. But we're going to take the slow route just to show you how the process goes. Okay, so how do you use the magic number to help answer this question? All right, first of all, the answer is in the subnet mask. So you take the subnet mask and you say slash 27 and you write that out in binary. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, dot. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, dot. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and a dot. Now that's 24 bits. So now the last octet, 1, 2, 3, right? 25th, 26th, 27th bit. Then you put in your zeros, okay? 8 bits, right? And you, all you need to know is what is the, the last one, what is its place value in the binary number scheme? Okay? Well, in the binary number scheme, you've got 8 bits, and it's 2 to the 0, 2 to the 1, 2 to the 2, 2 to the 3rd power, 2 to the 4th power, 2 to the 5th power, 6th power, and 2 to the 7th power. And if you do that, 2 to the 0 is the 1's place, 2 to the 1 is the 2's place. 2 to the 2, 2 times 2 is 4. That's the 4's place. 2 times 2 times 2 is the 8's. 16, 32, 64, and 1 28th place. So if we have that chart of our place values in binary, we see that this bit right here, this last one, is in the 32's place the third one over from left to right. So it is a, the magic number in this case is what? 32. Magic number is 32. Magic number, 32. Okay, so now we answer the question. If we know that the magic number is 32, then we know that the networks, okay, in this subnetted scheme where we've broken up what would have been the 196.16.144 network with a slash 24, we've broken it up, made it a slash 27, and now we have multiple networks, right? Multiple subnets. And what are those networks? The magic number tells us that they go up by 32. So the networks are 0 to 31, that's the first network, 32 to 63, that's the second network, 64 to 95, that's the next network, and then the next network is 96, and every time it goes up by 32. What's 96 plus 32? 128. What's 128 plus 32? 160. 160 plus 32? 192. 224, right? Plus 32 is 255, that's the end, or plus 32 is 256, that's the end. So those are the networks, and here's this number, 64, right? Well, 64 is the network number, 95 is the broadcast number, and anything in between is what we call a usable host. So in this scenario, this number, 196.16.144.64, this is a network address. You guys got it? That makes it easy, right? Okay, should we do another one? Absolutely, let's do it in the next video.